I'm getting ready to jump in the shower. That's right. I'm due for a little shampoo. <laughs> Actually, I'm due for a trim, as you can see. And I've gotten a few requests from people asking me to show them how to give themselves a layered haircut or how to trim their own layered haircut so they don't have to go to the hairdresser all the time. And it's actually very simple. So give me a few seconds in the shower and I'll be right out. La 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 First, I use my favorite shampoo. That's right, Tresemme. Followed with my favorite conditioner. Yes, Tresemme. <laughs> I'm going to let the mirrors unsteam and go get dressed. I'll be right back. <laughs> You're going to need a brush, a comb, and some scissors. Get them ready. Okay, it's time to remove the towel. <sighs> and add your favorite conditioner. Just a little dab, you know. Run it all the way through. It's easier to comb that way. Okay. Dry off your hands. <laughs> Pick up your brush. And comb all the way through. No tangles. That's what counts. Now <laughs> comes the fun part. You're actually going to tilt your head over. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> and comb it the opposite direction. Everything down. And then grab it with your hand like you would with the rubber band. Pull it straight up, but actually up to an angle. You want the back of your hair to be towards your eyeball so that you can see it. See, I can see what's happening right there. And then you take your hand and angle it. See, they get a little closer for you to see here what I'm doing. And just flatten it out. See how my hand did that? Hopefully you saw how my hand did that. And you're going to see what's happening with your hair. And voila, you're going to grab your scissors in one clean swoop. Open them up. <laughs> and you're going to determine your guideline being the shortest part in front right here. And then you're going to come up on an angle and just snip. Snip, 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 snip. Now see how straight that line is? That means everything is completely in line. <laughs> but to cross check it, again, you're gonna pick up your brush, go like that. Now you're gonna grab your comb because your comb will separate everything. And come forward like this, so that you can see it in front of your eyes. Again, you want to be able to see what's happening. Move your hand down. Now see how you can see what's happening right there. Grab your scissors. It'll keep sliding down. And then you're going to snip it. Just like that. Can you see what I just did? <laughs> now, you're going to pick it up again with the comb just to make sure you got it all good. Because, you know, this is a foolproof method of giving yourself a layered haircut. It really is because you see how much you're cutting. Now twist your hair. That's right. Twist it. And then you're going to go and look to see if there's anything hanging on the edge there. And as I can see, there's just one little strand. Can you see right there? And then snip it. Now see how it's all there? Now shake it all out. <laughs> and blow dry. <laughs> Just that easy. And you don't cut off too much hair. That's the main thing, you know. 
when you let somebody else layer your hair, sometimes you run the risk that they cut it too short. This way, you're only cutting off the tips and you're being as precise as you can be simply by bringing all your hair forward and seeing what you're doing. Okay, I'm going to dry it and show it to you. <laughs> Before blow drying your hair, don't forget to <laughs> wipe up the mess you just made. <laughs> By the way, if you have any type of curl in your hair and you layer your hair, it's really going to bring out that curl. Finish this up with a few rollers. Yeah, a couple of rollers really brings out the layers, I think. <laughs> but it's so much easier to curl when you have those layers. See? You're just, everything's even. But yeah, just plop them in there. Just a couple is all you really need. I use the clippies. Just split it down the middle. I said you only need like two or three. <laughs> Just for a quick look, quick set as we like to call it. It's referred to as, yeah, just a couple to make it a little softer, a little shinier. And then a little more controlled. Uh, bring up the bangs if you want, you know. But the hot rollers also kind of straightens it out a little bit if you want it to. They are hot. <laughs> but I'm not a big fan of curling irons, but I do love my hot rollers. Okay. Take it down. Whew. Just that quick, yeah. That's why I like hot rollers. They're quick. <laughs> quick and easy. Relatively painless. Okay, and now, as you can see, the finished product of that layered haircut, you can see the lines in the hair. That's how I judge a layered haircut, whether or not you can see any lines in the hair. <laughs> there you go. Much better. And then, if you want, just give a little, add just a little more conditioner to your hand. And just run it through your dry hair, that's right. Because it brings out those lines even more. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so that was the tutorial on how to do your own layered haircut trim in your own bathroom without having to go anywhere. Hopefully that helped. If you have any other questions, get in touch with me. <laughs> Okay, before I take off, just just know that, you know, if you have longer hair than what I do, the outcome for you will be slightly different, but it's still going to turn out with precise, you know, layers. <laughs> and that's the object, right? So, uh, for the best results, do be sure to have a brush, a comb, and your scissors. Be sure to have your hair be thoroughly shampooed prior to doing it, or at least thoroughly wet. And make sure when you're pulling it over that you can actually see it with your eyes. That way you don't cut off too much. Okay? But yeah. <laughs> Layered haircuts are actually pretty easy to give to yourself, provided uh, <laughs> you're not afraid to do it. <laughs> Bye for now.